Steve, prawns and pork scratchings in the same recipe, bring it on. It's an unusual combination of flavours, but I'm really up for the challenge it represents. Now I've got to serve a white wine here, but I want something that's quite rich and flavoursome to cope with that umami in the dish. I'm also looking for something off dry. Now if you're feeling flush, you can go with something like this Gewürztraminer from Alsace, deliciously spicy. But I think I've found something that works even better with every element of this dish. It comes from New Zealand and it's the 2011 Waimea Pinot Gris. Pinot Gris and Pinot Grigio are the same grape variety, but they're often made in different styles. Pinot Grigio tends to be light and fairly neutral and mostly comes from Italy, whereas Pinot Gris is produced in Alsace, Oregon and as we have here, the South Island of New Zealand, and it's quite a bit richer and more textured. On the nose, this is rich and creamy with lots of exotic spices and bags of fruit. On the palate, even though the wine is off dry, it works really nicely with the delicate flavours of the tiger prawns. There's a smoky undertone, typical of the Pinot Gris grape, which picks up on the smoked bacon relish. And there's a spiciness, which is the perfect complement for the garlic mayonnaise and the savoury sensation of the popcorn pork coating. Steve, what a great recipe for your Saturday Kitchen debut. I hope this wine does it justice. <laughs>